What's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I am going to be installing new toy mirrors I got for my F-250 and I also bought uh, rear tail lights but I installed those last night, I couldn't wait. Um, so today I'm just going to be installing the new toy mirrors. These are for the newer style uh, model, the 2008 and up, the squared ones and I'm going to show you guys right now. So. These fit the 99 to 07 style F250s, F350s, and F450s. So these it's are it, guys. It's a wire. Okay, it comes with the smoked lens right here, the amber and turning signal. It also comes with the integrated mirror turning signal right here. And yeah, it comes and with the wire too. It comes with the adapter for the 99 to 03 models, I think it is. So I'm gonna get be getting these installed right now. I think I'm gonna have to do some wiring, rewiring on these, because I got these from Amazon and I was reading that the blue and white wire aren't the same as the OEM ones. So I'm gonna be swapping the connection off of this, the pigtail, uh, white with blue and blue with white. All right, guys. few moments later all right guys just to show you guys how the truck looks like right now with these mirrors so this is how it looks right now that. and these are the headlights I installed and I'll show you guys the tail lights too these are the new style ones there. I like how these look because they have like they, they pop out a little bit from right here and look way better from the ones they used to have. So these are the ones they used to have. These ones right here. 
They're all cracked. This would be in place of this right here. All right guys, so let's get started. So this is the problem I'm having. So when I put, when I turn my running lights on, there, see that one's on? And I put the blinker on, that works, right? But then this stays on, the blinker right here with this running light. And when I put my blinker on, it's not blinking, it just stays constantly on. See right there, it's off, on, this one and this one so I have to do some rewiring like I said so what I'm doing is I'm removing the lock pin taking this out so I can pull the white and blue wire out and I'm gonna be swapping these vice versa so the blue one would bow go in the uh, white position and the white would go in the blue position Nos la hacemos corto la verga. Oh, make sure you put the fucking thing back on. Make sure you guys put the lock, lock pin back on. Hopefully it's just that, guys, because I don't want to do no more fucking rewiring. A ver si sirve. Okay, so now we just have the running light on. So let's put the blinker. Oh, wouldn't you know that? Look at that. It's working, guys. So now I have my blinker on, and the mirror blinker is also blinking at the same time. So I have my running lights are off. They're on. Off. On. They're off. Now I'm going to take the blinker off, and it's off. Blinker back on. Off, on, off, and then the running lights are on. Now I put my blinker on. As you can see, it's working good now. So basically what you have to do on these, if you guys do buy them, is you have to switch, like I said, just switch the white and the blue wire, vice versa. Put the blue wire where the white wire goes and the white wire where the blue wire goes. That's basically it, and then just plug it in. Otherwise, it's just gonna be having the same problem I have. I'm gonna have to do the same thing for the passenger side so I can get that working. But this one's done. I think I'm also have to do, trim a little bit of the spacer. This one right here, there's like a little spacer in between right here, this one. I have to trim that off a little bit, maybe. Guys, 
so I am gonna have to trim this face rough because it's not allowing it to sit flush. Hopefully this works. I'm just gonna fold this down and it's this tab right here. It's not allowing it to sit flush. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna get my vice grips. It's flush. how they look I like the angle of them how they they sit straight they don't have like a, a bend to it like that like the Silverado ones if you if you have a Silverado you know you might notice that they're not sitting straight like this they're actually sitting like this I don't know why that is but these ones sit straight Look at that, guys. That's a huge difference already. Look at that. Look at that right there. All right, guys, so I'm gonna put the door panel back on. I already got the driver's side done. I'm gonna move over to the uh, passenger side as soon as I get the door panel back on, so.
All right, guys, so I just finished installing my mirrors already, and uh, I'm gonna give you guys a walk around of how it looks right now. All right guys, so that's gonna be it for this video. Um, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna see if I order the sunroof kit so I can uh, record that. Uh, so it can finally work already, cause I want that to work. So I'm gonna be ordering the kit sometime this week. And uh, that would be probably the next video and maybe I'll wash it, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, comment, I'll put down the parts, all the parts I got for this truck down in the description just if maybe you guys want to buy them if you guys have the same truck as mine. Uh, but yeah guys, uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe. I'm new to this stuff, I'm kind of embarrassed. Being on camera is kind of weird, especially when other people are staring at you, so it's kind of weird talking to the camera. It's my first time doing this, so eventually hopefully I get used to it. I keep uh, putting better content out for you guys. And like I said, it's, this is not the only truck that's going to be on the channel. It's going to be uh, my Silverado and my Lightning too. So yeah, guys, make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up and uh, see you guys on the next video.